South Australia and I'm bringing you another wig review. This time it's this lovely lady, her name is Becky and she's by Aesthetica Designs and she's in the colour R1426H. <laughs> I'm not a natural blonde by any stretch of the imagination, but I actually really like this colour. Um, this colour 1426H, uh, I'll do a separate review about this colour because it is actually really nice, it's really quite subtle, but we're not here to talk about colour, we're here to talk about the wig. This is Becky. You can see she's got some great curls here, very feminine, quite long, um, and she's got a fringe coming down the front. Becky is really, really simple. She's inexpensive, um, she's really good quality, the hair fibre is beautiful, um, but she's not got any of the big bells and whistles that you get on a lot of the fancier wigs. So there's no lace front here, okay? If I pull this back, you can see there's no lace there at all. So she needs to have a fringe. You need to have that covering in some way so that you don't show that line coming across the top. She's also completely open capped, okay? So she doesn't have any kind of monofilament top or uh, part or crown, nothing like that. She's a straight machine made open wefted cap. And because of that, she's inexpensive, okay? But that doesn't mean that she's cheap, right? You can see the quality of this, this wig is just beautiful. I mean, it's so feminine. The curls are just gorgeous. You're looking at, oh, let's see, um, the fringe here, about nine centimeters, so it's not too long. Just can come off to the side there. You can always trim that down if you wanted to have it come a little bit straighter, but I actually like to have it come across the side. Um, the nape back here, you're looking at about 33 centimeters. From the crown down, about 30, 30 and a half centimeters. So she's quite long. Um, this isn't this isn't a short style. This is a long style. You could pull it back to a low pony. You could probably also pull it back a little bit into a high pony like that if you wanted to. Um, you could do quite a bit. This wig's quite versatile, but because there's no monofilament, you do have to be a little bit careful with the top. There is permitters in this wig. There has to be because that's how they're going to be able to cover up some of the wefting. Um, but it's you can see at the top here. It's really quite subtle. It's not, it's not in your face, and this style is not huge either. I mean, I don't feel like I've got, you know, Farrah Fawcett huge hair here because I haven't, and I'm quite little. So for me to wear this wig is actually very, very comfortable. Being open capped and being an aesthetica, um, this will stretch. Um, it's a really good size. I have quite a small head, but I actually find it fits me quite comfortably. You can see here. The coverage comes down here. That's my bio hair, you can see underneath there. Um, so that coverage is actually really excellent. Comes down a long way. You can see down the sides as well. It's got, it's a really comfortable style. It's sitting quite close here and you can see at the back, she comes down quite low. So it should fit you if you've got a smaller head, but it should also fit you if you're from the larger head tribe instead of being the pokey head tribe like I am. Uh, let me take her off and I'll show you the cap construction. So here we are with Becky on the inside of the cap. You can see straight away there's no lace front um, and all of this um, cap is machine made. Okay, So up here is probably where you're going to be finding your permatease um, and the rest is all open capped. Uh, over here you can see that the ear tabs are open which is great if you wear glasses because you can put your glasses straight through there and the hair comes all the way down those ear tabs which is really good come around the back you can see she's got a slightly extended nape here it's not a felt nape and the adjusters are a little bit different here they're little hooks so you just choose where you want it to hook in and you go along with both sides and if you're looking for a bit of stretch this has definitely 
got stretch and lots of it. So if you've got a larger head, you'll probably find this to be a very comfortable style to wear. The blondes always look really nice on these curly styles, you know. It makes you feel quite summery and, and happy, you know. It's a ha this is a happy wig, okay. This is, this is the kind of wig you go out when you want to feel happy, okay. You could wear this anywhere. Um, and being so reasonably priced, you could wear this every day. She's stunning. So this is Kat. I've been from Wig Warrior in South Australia. You can find our website. It's at what 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 dot wigwarrior dot com dot au. Go and check out Becky. She just might be the one you're looking for. Thanks for watching. I'll see you on our next review.